First and foremost, I hope you and your families are safe and sound. I want to talk a little bit about my space and the impact of COVID-19, which has been profound and continues to be so. I follow cyclical broadly, but specifically around construction, commercial vehicles, uh, food equipment, agriculture, and mining. And every space has been deeply impacted and will continue to be so, though we do think there are some opportunities and pockets for long-term investors for sure. Now, the impact of this space has been quick and deep. In other words, April is probably the bottom. It doesn't get much lower than zero. Uh, many of the factories have been shut and demand has really screeched to a halt. And that followed a very difficult March. But that means the second quarter is probably the bottom. And as we go through the second half of the year, we'll start to see more and more factories come online. We'll start to see some more ordering. And we do expect a better condition and better numbers ahead, which we hope to carry through into 2021. Obviously, that's going to be a little bit contingent on the broader economy, the pace of the vaccine, and how we tackle this as society. Now, on the focus of that, let's think about what is different now and what will be different in the next few years, if not longer. We think probably one of the biggest changes that impacts my group will be the focus on safety, safe equipment, safe technology, and really safety for the individual employee. But we think safety, especially food safety, is going to be one of the really long-term secular changes that drives more automation, more technology adoption to take workers out of harm's way and to replace them with automation and reallocate that human resource. So we know there's a lot of challenges in the commercial food service space, for example, given that we're all not rushing back to restaurants right away. But food processing companies, once we get past this, this bottom over the next few months, and as the processing plants get back up and running full steam, we think the food safety trend will be really profound over the next few years, if not longer. I think that's probably the biggest change we're gonna see. And there is still a lot of risk in names, especially around commercial, for example, agriculture, for example. Uh, but let's not forget that humans continue to eat. We still hope for growth in the middle class and production, protein consumption and production continues to increase. I think these are valuable and long-term trends that will continue 